Yo, 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 welcome back to Street T Studios. I'm glad you came back. I hope you liked, hope you subscribed. Um, today we are working with my white toner i560 Uninet printer. And today we're gonna put um work on putting two shirts in my shop um from a design that I created. I know you can't barely see it, but It'll look better once once it's printed. So um, let's get to it. Yeah. First, we're going to start off with the step A transfer paper by placing it into the white corner printer's bypass tray. That way, it is printed on the dull side so we can get a good print. Now, after hitting print on our computer, we're just waiting for the software to rip over to the white toner printer so it can print our image and we can go on to the next step. One of my favorite part of this whole process is watching the artwork being printed out to see how it turns out. And that looks fantastic. I can't wait to put it on the shirt. Step A, transfer paper, and our Step B, adhesive paper. We need to marry the two papers together on the heat press for 330 degrees Fahrenheit for 120 seconds with medium pressure. After that, we need to get a, a cloth or a t-shirt and rub some of that heat off and cool it down. That way we can peel the image from the adhesive paper so we can get that adhesive backing on our design. Now our image has the adhesive backing on it. Now we're ready to press on our t-shirt. Now with our Bella Canvas 100% cotton t-shirt already on our heat press, we want to press the design for 310 degrees Fahrenheit for 30 seconds with medium pressure. Allow your design to cool down for at least five minutes. It's a cold peel, not a hot peel. You want to allow it to cool down so you can get a low but slow peel. second design is something I was working on for myself. I was going out and I wanted a new shirt for myself. And this, you know, Disney's Recess. I was a big fan as a kid. So I wanted to do something special for myself and just make it a shirt. I had a great idea. I wanted to bring it to life. So now we're going to print it. We're going to see how it turns out.
Wow, I was surprised and stunned on how it came out. When I seen it slide out the printer, I just was so amazed and I just stared at it for a while. <laughs> it's gonna look even better on the shirt I chose. We're gonna check it out. Okay, we're gonna repeat those same steps for the marrying process. We're gonna take the step A paper and mirror it to the step B so we can get a good adhesive stick on the back of our design so we can place it on our shirt and it can look wonderful. Now this is the second part of the design for the recess shirt. This is the wording. Now it's time again to press both designs on the shirt at 310 degrees for 30 seconds. Can't wait to see what this looks like. Let's go. Take it off the heat press and let it cool so we can peel it. Wow, that design came out way better than I thought it would. Came out crisp, clean, and real clear. Now let's take a look at each shirt and the design and how it came out. I really like this recent shirt. Can't speak any highly more than I already have. It just turned out wonderful. I love it. black and red design on a white shirt of the Detroit What Up Though shirt that I created. I hope you guys love it. It'll be available on my Etsy shop real soon. I just love the way it turned out on that white. And here is the black version of that shirt. The white lettering in the city behind it with the red Detroit. Okay, wait till you guys check this out on my website, my Etsy shop. Once again, go ahead and check that out. It turned out great. I'm very happy. I'm very satisfied. I hope you guys like it too. What's going on everybody? I really hope you enjoyed that video. If you did, do me a favor. Like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that notification button for the next few videos. I plan on doing great work and I want you guys to be here to enjoy with me. Um, and do me a favor also look at our previous video, which was the Chrome Lux panels, the 11 by 14. Check that out as well. 
Um, I hope to see you guys around again for the next few videos. And please, please have a wonderful, prosperous day. Peace. One. Thank <laughs> you.